you know, processing power and, and learning things about road conditions and vehicle to vehicle and vehicle to in infrastructure. Um, what sort of developments are we seeing right now and what sort of things have changed in the past 12 months? Are we getting closer to having a vehicle to vehicle and v, v to I and V to V, of course, uh, in the U.S. or, uh, or are we still uh, quite a ways away from that sort of thing? I mean, when you look at vehicles, even mainstream vehicles like a Ford Focus, right? This is not a luxury uh, vehicle. It has uh, a lot of driver assist technologies using the sensors, using uh, radar, using the sensor fusion, which are all steps towards that autonomy. And now putting in the, the modems and the connectivity and the infotainment is all the building blocks to get there. Uh, the work that is happening, uh, not only for V2V, V2V is work as part of autonomy uh, into the future, looking at, uh, you know, we're part of the, standard, the standards we're developing, because the only way that will work is many, many vehicles from many OEMs on the road using that. So that is a lot of work towards the standards, towards uh, making that part of the future autonomy. But the work that really the work that is really accelerating is when you look at the the reliability of the sensors and the data that we're collecting and a lot of the you know companies in the industry are collecting and getting that uh, to the level of reliability that the customer really expects to take that to a full autonomous is the real challenging work uh, to get there uh, we'll get the standards we'll get the communication we'll get the data uh, but we need the reliability, and that's why you don't see that on the road today. We've just announced we have 30 fusion hybrids uh, that, that are fully autonomous, but that, that really is using a lot of these building blocks that are already on the roads. I mean, you can, you can parallel park, perpendicular park, you, get, you got lane keeping, all the stuff in a Ford Focus today. You can buy it. Uh, that's all steps towards that, and then the, the data from uh, the roads uh, we do see that progressing maybe in more controlled air, you know, area, geofenced area where you can get to that level uh, soon in the next few years. And then that is all building the momentum towards full autonomous, including B2B.